Reportedly, there is another new Marvel game in development, but this one will be starring Carol Danvers, AKA Captain Marvel, and it might actually be amazing. Huh? What it do, Drag Nation? I'm back with Super News, bringing you the latest superhero news in five minutes or less because I respect your time if you subscribe. So if this information was valuable, hit the like button so it will reach more people. But if it wasn't for you, change it to a dislike. Disney has been very busy helping spread the Marvel brand through video games lately. In addition to basically turning Insomniac into a Marvel studio for the next decade with expected sequels and spinoffs to their Spider-Man universe like Venom, they also have the upcoming Marvel's Wolverine. Meanwhile, we've got a Marvel's Blade game coming from Arcane Leon, Skydance's Rise of Hydra, and solo games for Iron Man and Black Panther. Not to mention Marvel Rivals, the multiplayer hero shooter that has taken the industry by storm during its series of public tests. Rivals topped 50,000 players just on Steam, despite intentionally limiting the amount of people who can access the game during its new beta test that has also allowed console players to get in on the action. Now we can apparently add Captain Marvel to the list. This information can came via a leak from insider account V Scooper. They are best known for their movie and television leaks and even provided a helpful thread of everything they got right in order to show off how reliable their information usually is. Well, this time they stepped into the video game world reporting that there was a Captain Marvel game currently in development. V Scooper didn't add any additional details, but I think I have enough of my own information to shed some light on this mystery. I've been keeping very close tabs on all the superhero games in development, both announced and unannounced announced. If there is a Captain Marvel game being made, it's most likely coming from EA. They signed a three game deal with Disney two years ago, but so far have only announced Iron Man and Black Panther. Jeff Grubb, who leaked the existence of both games before they were officially revealed, was unable to find out the identity of the third game as he said it was so early in the development phase they hadn't picked a hero yet. A Captain Marvel game is a very interesting curveball. Even though she's not exactly the most popular of of heroes in the MCU and might not even be in it anymore after that last flop, there was definitely a demand and interest in getting Captain Marvel in video games. She was part of the main cast in the hugely underrated gem Marvel's Midnight Suns and was supposed to be added to the now shut down Marvel's Avengers in its final expansion. If it's EA publishing the game, we can expect it to be single player open world action in Unreal Engine 5. But with Captain Marvel as the main character, people who have been hoping for a Superman game might want to take note. Not only is Carol very powerful with the ability to fly, but a lot of her stories also take her through outer space to strange worlds. Having space battles with the Kree, blowing up enemies and vehicles with energy attacks, that all sounds like a good time to me if they do it right, especially when it comes to Captain Marvel's cosmetics. I'll keep you informed if we learn anything more, which might be happening sooner than you think, but that's for another video. In the meantime, if you're not as interested in Captain Marvel, Marvel Spider-Man 3 finally got a gameplay leak, but unlike the Wolverine leak, this story actually has a happy ending where no developers are harmed. Click the video on screen to learn more.